Hi guys. Mostly in cities, have you ever experienced an intensive heat and poor air quality inside and outside your house? Then this technique will definitely be one of your solutions. Let me introduce myself. My name is Vinay. And if you are visiting my channel for the first time, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Also, click the bell icon. Let's start the video. So what is green roof? A green roof is a layer of vegetation planted over a waterproofing system that is installed on the top of a flat or slightly sloped roof. Green roofs are also known as vegetative or eco-friendly roofs. They fall into three main categories: extensive, intensive, and semi-intensive. Although there are no precise definitions of them, an extensive green roof has shallow growing medium. usually less than 6 inches these grow up to only 6 inches with a modest roof load limited plant diversity minimal water requirements and is often not accessible and next intensive green roofs have more soil and a deeper growing medium sometimes several feet that can support a more diverse plant sections including small trees thus they have more substantial structural loads and need more frequent maintenance and watering they are usually accessible semi intensive green roofs include features of both types the appropriate depth of any green roof depends on the roof structure the plan chosen annual rainfall and storm water performance requirements and there is also other type of green roof that is modular green roof some green roofs are installed in one large integrated sections while modular green roofs use some portable planting beds placed together to create a large green roof the modular units are often plastic or metal trays filled with growing medium modular green roofs can be installed incrementally and can easily removed for maintenance and inspection of the roof layers underneath one drawback however is that moisture cannot flow between units increasing the impacts of wet and dry spells on the plants Next we talk about layers of green roof. All three types of roofs require specific layers of roofing material not found on regular roofs. The basic anatomy of a green roof consists of vegetation, growing media, filter membrane, drainage layer, waterproof or root repellent layer, roofing membrane support for planting above, thermal insulation, vapor control layer and structural roof support. Each of these layers perform a specific function to keep the plants alive and to protect the structure beneath. So we discuss definition types and layers of the green roof. Now we talk about advantages and disadvantages. First advantages. These improve dryness system and these also increase the life span of the roof. Green roofs boost the thermal performance and these also help out the environment in many ways. These also support wildlife habitats. and green roofs also increases air quality the main disadvantages of green roof is that these green roofs are expensive than the traditional roofs but worthwhile in the long term use because these saves energy and helps the environment the other disadvantage is that the dead load due to green roofs increase on the structure and these require extra maintenance these roofing systems are used in some countries but in india these are very expensive the government should give incentives for who install these green roofs thank you for watching the video if you like our video please give a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my channel also click the bell icon see you in the next video thank you